this is a standard size weasel light. This is a weasel micro. Let's see how we go. Really flim, uh, not flimsy. What's the word? Nervous. Oh, let's see if we can do a looping. No, we cannot. Oops. Then I go and get it. Can't you leave it or something? Whoa! That's <laughs> good! <Yeah. laughs> Wait, are you I wouldn't say you did incredibly well though. I wouldn't want to drop it. Maybe once you get a bit better, do I want to say? Otherwise, it might. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not very good. <laughs> when did you get it? I built it. Oops. <laughs> so we crashed and had to do a, a quick repair. The tip of the other corner of the wing came off. Dimensions and a list of everything I used in here uh, is in the description, so I'm not going to repeat that again. The good news is that it flies, which wasn't given at all. It's also quite cool in that it's tiny, it looks like an envelope. The bad news is that it flies like an envelope too. It's very twitchy. This actually has a higher wing loading than the standard Weasel Light which meant that it wasn't quite the super light wind weasel that I was hoping for. It flies okay, um, but it's very twitchy. It was a mistake not to tape the entire wingtip. I broke it here and I taped it out on the slope, um, but a bit of tape all the way here would have probably stopped it from breaking in the first place. I taped it about two thirds of the way on both sides, but I should have taped it all the way. So what improvements can you do? Probably make it lighter again. Uh, the battery is quite heavy for its size, so it needs to sit there to get the CD right. Um, so if I were to go for a lighter battery, I would need to put it out on a stick or on a bit of a fuselage or something, which would kind of take away a little bit from the look. A lot of things worked, the ailerons worked, I mean, they are tiny, they are not covered in tape, it's just balsa. Um, control holes worked, I'm very pleased with that. And my uh, push rods worked as well. They're as about as simple as you can get. Very happy with the servos, they are tiny but they work really well. 3.7 grams each, probably without the lace, mind you. The fins seem to be adequate. It was a little bit wobbly from time to time. Whether that was a lack of fin or not, I couldn't really tell. I'll have to fly again. I went on medium throws, up and down elevator, and a bit more on ailerons. And that seemed to work okay. The maximum throws had more elevator, 